Alex, most Americans probably think of turbocharging as a way to get more power out of an engine. But lately we've seen an emergence in Ford's EcoBoost technology and other companies using turbocharging as a way to actually get better fuel economy and emissions. And you've been telling me that what we're going to see with uh, Honeywell's turbocharging technology is a huge penetration of the market in an effort to meet environmental regulations. Is that right? How, how big a penetration are we talking about? The turbo revolution has already started, and it's available at your dealership in the U.S., like everyone, everywhere else in the world. Honeywell, as the uh, market and technology leadership, will provide those fuel-efficient solutions to consumers. And you're going to see a large-scale turbo adoption growing from about 30% today globally to more than 70% by 2025. And in the U.S., uh, turbo penetration on light vehicles has started as well. It was about uh, 5% in 2009 and will grow to about 20% by 2015. This turbo revolution is available at your dealership. Go for it. And we're also going to see turbocharging on hybrids, as we already do with the uh, BMW X6. We do, and turbochargers are complementary to hybrids. They just uh, provide a fuel-efficient and emission-compliant solution at, uh, and, fuel per and fuel performance and drivability for the consumers. Thank you. Thank you.